Hello, this is Spinhead Year. If you're wondering why I sound like Stephen Hawking, it's because my good mic is in storage and I'm done recording with my laptop's fantastic <laughs> built-in mic. Today I thought I'd try something different and review a Minecraft mod, Divine RPG. Divine RPG is an old SN mod for Minecraft that came out roughly around the Permian period. Recently it just got updated to 1.16, but it's been around since before 1.7.10. Feel old yet? In this mod, after defeating the Ender Dragon, you fight several cosmic horrors and overpowered demons until you have enough materials to enter the several magical twilight dimensions and get royally ass fucked by unicows and abominations against nature what until you have a weapon so ridiculously strong that small creatures run in terror of your massive dropping cock. It's just too bad that the strongest sword in the mod looks like a fucking chandelier. <laughs> like every Minecraft mod, you start by digging a hole to fucking China until you have enough glint to make a rapper piss himself and probably have arms so jacked you look like you beat your meat for 8 hours a day. Once you defeat the nightmare-reducing boss monsters that are impossible to beat without a goddamn strategy, you can use your stupid magic clock to explore these acid trippy dimensions. Featuring the yellow one, the blue one, the purple one, the depressing gray one, nether two, nether harder, the creepy occultish labyrinth one, and the literal fucking nightmare one where you have no weapons and have to fight actual fucking Satan. You can also use a magic snow globe to enter a frozen Christmas hell. This mod has a metric shit ton of content including 50 bajillion mobs, tons of weapons including magically powered machine guns, and so many new colorful building materials you can feel like you just entered a fucking My Little Pony rave. Also pumpkins. This mod is really fun, despite being hard as walls. But while it adds a lot of content and is very self-contained, it's such a complete package that it takes a lot of tinkering with it to make it compatible with other mods in terms of progression. If you combine it with the wrong mod, it can easily render half of the weapons useless if you keep certain weapons attainable early game. <laughs> Overall I would still recommend it though. Its weird cosmic aesthetic is very nostalgic and reminds me a lot of early Minecraft. You know, before it was ruined by five-year-olds. You're both dick tits. Stop calling his name, that's not nice. You should apologize. Shut up, dick tit. Thanks for watching. If you like this kind of content, leave a comment letting me know and I'll make more like it in the future. Oh, sweet! Hot tub! Yeah, that's... Why don't you go try out the new hot tub, bro? Go on, I give I it a try. I don't wanna. No, go ahead, it's fine. <laughs>